Hello. In this video, you will learn about how we grow single crystal thin films using pulse laser deposition. Physical properties of materials such as optical, magnetic, electric, elastic, etc. stem from the constituent elements and the underlying crystal structure. For a given set of constituent elements, these physical properties depend strongly on the way the atoms or ions are arranged in the material. Therefore, by manipulating the crystal structure of a material, it is possible to tailor properties, even induce properties that were previously absent of a material. Pulse laser deposition, or PLD, is one of the techniques used for manipulating crystal structure, and hence properties of materials. We are creating thin films. Thin films have been implemented in TV screens, computers, cell phones, etc. The two images on the right are of our PLD system we are talking about in this video. The top image is of the chamber, the bottom image is of the laser on the right, the guiding system in the center, and then the chamber is on the left. PLD works by having a high-powered laser hit a target material, and when that happens, it will break apart the molecules and create high-energy plasma. Plasma has positive ions and free electrons. This means the plasma will stick onto a crystalline substrate above the target. The substrate lattice acts as a template for the plasma to cool and orient itself on. This is when the target material is changing physical properties and creating a thin film. For the target material to have its atoms move about and orient like the substrate lattice material, the atoms need to have enough energy to do so. PLD uses an infrared laser to heat an inconel absorber where it would transfer the heat to the substrate evenly. This gives the target atoms enough time to move and orient to the substrate lattice. So in this animation right now, the substrate is cold. So when the atoms move onto it, they don't have enough energy to move about and orient how we want them to. So we heat up the inconel absorber. So now when the atoms move down to the substrate, now have the energy to orient how we want them to. In addition to the energy the atoms get from the heat substrate, the particles also bring energy when they are deposited onto the substrate because of their higher speed. Watch our next two videos where we go in depth on the laser this PLD system uses and how we analyze how our material is deposited.